several areas in UK September 21st, 2023, where widespread storms and floods have paralyzed residents' activities. Roads turn into the reverse after monsoon rain, with more coming from Hurricane Nigel hit UK. The London Authority tackled numerous calls as people reported flooding in the capital following heavy downpours. Hey, hey here we go, puddles! With heavy rain only set to get worse ahead of Hurricane Nigel, the Met Office has warned of potential flooding and the possibility of interruption to power oh, supplies. Officials ask drivers to avoid flood weather and find alternative routes as a foot of moving water at just 6 miles per hour is enough to float a car. <laughs> Earlier in the day, flood alerts had been issued for parts of Greater London as river levels began to rise. One social media user joked she wasn't sure whether to run or swim around the street of London, while another compared it to monsoon weather in Croydon. The downpour comes as the tail end of Hurricane Lee prompts flood warnings in parts of England and Wales with yellow weather warnings issued for heavy rain this week. It comes as Nigel, a Category 1 hurricane, is impact the UK on Thursday and Friday as it continues to travel across the Atlantic Ocean. The latest warning, which was in place from 4 p.m. on Wednesday until 3 a.m. on Thursday, said commuters face potentially longer journeys with bus and train service affected, while spray and flooding on routes probably making journey times longer. Oh my gosh. Some areas were to see 15 to 20 mm of rainfall within an hour and up to 30 to 40 mm over 2 to 3 hours. Warnings of strong winds were also issued for western Scotland with parts of the highlands due to experience gusts of 50 until 60 mile per hour. Forecaster believe that Nigel has likely reached its peak intensity and will start to weaken as it moves into cooler waters but will still bring unsettled weather. In Nevada, a low-pressure system centered right over Las Vegas produced widespread rain, thunderstorms, some hill and flash flooding. A flooding advisory concluded at 6 p.m. for much of the valley and a flood warning that was effective for the Silverado Ranch, Henderson area expired at the same time. Brighter skies greeted commuters around 5 p.m. as most of the storm clouds moved northeast of the valley near Mesquite. By 6.30 p.m., the valley was clear of rain. A throw of colder air that moved from the Pacific Northwest toward Las Vegas, bringing the low pressure, will develop into windy condition Thursday.
More than 1.38 inches of rain fell at a bridge behind a shopping center at Eastern Avenue and the 215 Beltway. The Regional Transportation Commission reported heavy flooding in the area. A few rail stores in the area were temporarily closed to deal with flooding. The storm began shortly after noon, and the National Weather Service said it was expected to move northeast of the valley quickly, but rain persisted and expanded with light no moderate showers across most of the valley. Back into UK, while heavy showers are still expected to impact the UK, the math office say they are not expected to be as severe as those on Sunday, which caused more than 10,000 lightning strikes and so extreme airport flooded.